Welcome back. Buying a new car is a big commitment, and for some of us, vehicle ownership represents our longest and most committed relationship. But where do you start if you've been out of the game for a while? Well, to help you narrow your search and find the one and give you tips on how to stop swiping left, auto industry veteran and the director of corporate communications at Kia Motors America, James Bell. Hi, James. Oh, it's my pleasure. Thank you. So when you're looking for an SUV or a crossover, uh, what should you consider? Well, I know this sounds strange, but stick with me on this. Consider yourself. How are you really going to use this next vehicle? How many people are you going to have in it on a regular basis? How much room do you need for things in the back? Are you be loading bicycles or baby carriages or runs to the hardware store? Think about your life and you'll find that the SUV market is cut in lots of different sizes now and you'll find the perfect fit. And what are the features that everyone should look for? Well, safety obviously is very important to everybody and I think you'll find that today's cars are all very safe, loaded with airbags in every corner. But the most important, the most uh, safe vehicle, if you will, is the one that never has the accident in the first place. And these keys over my shoulder have all sorts of technology to help you avoid the accident. The best airbag is the one that's never used. Does size really matter when you're looking for an SUV or a crossover? Again, I think if you pull back and look at your lifestyle, then you'll find the right size. If you're going to be uh, driving the kids to school or soccer practice often basis, then you'll need that larger vehicle. Or uh, you just yourself and a couple friends, then maybe something smaller. Save yourself the fuel, save yourself the trouble, and get the right size. Well, what are the differences between Kia SUVs? Well, over my shoulder here, we have the Sportage, which is our younger, more kind of active lifestyle five passenger SUV. I think it's also a very good looking vehicle. Then we have the Sorento, our seven passenger, more family vehicle. Benchmarks against vehicles much higher in, in price and class, but a really luxurious place to be. And then our big, uh, our hotspot right now, the Telluride, up to eight passengers, 5,000 pounds towing. It's our, it's our beast right now and selling out across the country. Fabulous. Where can we go for some more information? Well, that's easy. You can go to Kia.com to learn about the vehicles here, or I suggest going to places like Kelly Blue Book or Edmunds.com to get their view. That third-party endorsement is really important, and they are loving Kia these days.